Hey YouTube, this is Mr. Zombie Fanatic, and welcome back to some Met for Dead action. Today, I am actually playing a custom map. Now, you may be thinking to yourself, hey, this map seems familiar. Wonder what it could be. This, my friends, is Narkadon Toten from War at War into Left 4 Dead 2. That's right, I got, um, I got Narkadon Toten from what I wore and downloaded it as a custom map. Well, I didn't do it. Somebody made a Left 4 Dead, somebody made a Left 4 Dead, um, custom map. And that's what we're playing today. So, of course, this is going to be very similar. I think. Wait, can we open this? This way, we'll lock after six minutes have passed. Okay, so that will open after six minutes. And I noticed that. Oh crap! They're coming in already. I noticed that this actually has the four old characters from the first Left 4 Dead. This is Left 4 Dead 2, but they're using Left 4 Dead 1 characters. So, Francis, Bill, Zoe, and, um, Francis, which is me. Which I think is really awesome that they're using, because I've never played Left 4 Dead 1. So it's really awesome that I'm playing them as the, I'm playing them as characters in Left 4 Dead 2. Seems pretty cool. Can he fit in through the thing? Now I am a total noob at Left 4 Dead. I'll just go ahead and tell you that right now. I'm a total noob. So I may do things that you get mad at or something. But I hope to start getting to some custom maps because some of these custom maps are really, really awesome. I haven't seen any more um Nazi zombie remakes other than this. Which I still think that is pretty awesome that they took Nocturne Totem. And they did a really good job on it. Because if you look, this looks exactly like Nocturne Totem. The first room. Of course, you don't have the shotgun on the walls and stuff. And you don't have a guitar on the wall. But this still looks pretty dang awesome. And, okay. I got guitar now, apparently. But yeah, like I said, I am a total noob whenever it comes to Left 4 Dead 2. So, I hope to get better as time goes on. I really hope so. But I hope to start playing a lot more custom maps on Left 4 Dead 2 than what I've been doing. Okay, I didn't even realize there was custom maps for Left 4 Dead 2. Which, it seems like every PC game will have some kind of mod or something for it. Like, Killer 4 has some custom maps. Left 4 Dead 2 does. Left 4 Dead 1 does, I think. Of course, what I War does. But we got these boards here, and they're not even tearing them down. What the heck? Okay. Go ahead and get that. Yeah, I seem like those, um... What are they called? Like boomers or something? Or uh, tanks? Yeah, I think they're tanks. It seems like they keep on getting stuck in here. Oh no, they're jockeys. Okay. Crap. I didn't even realize you could play these survival maps um, solo. I thought you only had to play co-op, but I just figured out how to play it solo. Which is really awesome since most of you guys know I'm a big solo player. I play co-op, oh crap. I play co-op every now and then, but I mainly, I mainly play, um, I mainly play solo. Just because I really like playing solo. I like playing by myself. But I'm going to try and get gold on this. I don't know how far I'll go after I get gold. As you can see up there, we'll fix it to get bronze. And we got it now. Next, we'll get silver at seven minutes. So I need to go ahead and heal up. So yeah, some of these maps will be freaking awesome. 
Some will be like easy, like this is not too bad. It's pretty easy, but it'd be a, a pain if the jockeys and stuff could actually come in here. But since they're so big, they can't. Because they can still hit you if you get close. But there we go. Oh, crap. Yeah, these little zombies can come in, though. It says that they're not tearing down the barriers. I was kind of hoping to see them tear down the barriers. But it's kind of cool that he's got the barriers, like, in the perfect spots, like it is on Nocturne Totem. He did a really good job on this map, though. I'm, I'm really loving this. And I'm still looking for some more, um, remakes of some What I Wore and Black Ops 1 maps and stuff to play them. Still looking for that. But this is the only one I could find. Come on, die. Oh crap, he's in. He's in. He is in. Oh crap. No, I'm down. Come on. Yeah, we're done. There's no way. And I'm dead. Well, made it 5 minutes at 38 seconds. I think we'll go play that again. We just gotta wait for it to load. Killed one hunter, three smokers, two boomers, one charger, two do jockeys, four spitters, and five tanks. Okay, so there we are. We are back. Go ahead and activate that again. Okay, go ahead and grab that. Okay. So, let's try this again, I guess. Oh, they do tear down these barriers, but they don't tear down the bottom ones. But they do tear down the top and the middle. What the heck is he doing on top of that car? And he said that he actually got some Nazi zombies in this to make it look more like what I wore. But... For some reason, these look the same. They don't look like Nazi zombies, like he said he had. That's kind of cool how he's got the... It would be awesome if he was somehow able to put Nikolai, Tokyo, Dempsey, and Rick Toffin in here, though. That would just be insane. But he's got the four Left for Dead 1 characters in here, though. Which is still pretty cool. So I'm going to try and hit go now. I hope I can. Crap, there's a boomer somewhere, I think. Oh, crap. Oh, no. He is in. We can't exactly rape train in this. If this was what I wore, I could rape train. Crap, I'm trying to kill that um, jockey over there. Yeah, I'm terrible with the names of all these things. All these different kinds of big zombies. I'm terrible with them. No. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Run. Let me go. Wow. Okay, let's try one more time. What I'm probably going to do for these is just try three times. And on my third time, if I die, then I'll just see how far I made it in total. I'm going to try it one more time and see how it does. Okay. It says doors were unlocked two time, two minutes after the match begins. Okay, so this will unlock. I didn't see that unlock last time, but it says it does. And this is six minutes. So I'm pretty sure that will be the last one. The top one, whenever we open that... The top one will probably um, unlock in four minutes, and then that will be six minutes. Is what I'm guessing anyway. But I did not notice that door opening before. But I guess I'll notice it this time. Crap. I'm sorry, teammates. There's a frying pan. Ain't nobody got time for that. Too bad you can't sprint on this game, though. Or can you? No, you can't. 
Unless I'm just pressing the wrong button. I don't even know what my sprint button is. Oh, crap. Do you got any grenades you could throw? I don't think so. So, as soon as that jockey comes in, that's when he things just go all messed up. Because once that jockey comes in, everybody just gets pwned. Because this room is not big enough to survive a jockey attack. Okay, so it seems like that's the end of that wave. I think I'm gonna get this. Okay, come on. Yeah, it seems like we have different waves too, just like we got rounds on. You know, after told it seems like we got waves on this. Okay, so that's a charger. And wow, this gun went to work on him. Oh crap, a boomer. Time to die. Time to die, stupid boomer. Oh, crap. No, get away from me. I can't die. Can't die. I want to get gold. There we go. Okay, so we have to walk up and press E. Oh, wow. It actually got a mystery box. Can I take that? Oh, my gosh. It actually does got a mystery box in this. So we can get different weapons and stuff. Of course it's not going to be what our war weapons. It's going to be Left 4 Dead 2 weapons. But still. That is freaking amazing. I wonder if they break through the wall too. Probably not. Probably they designed it for that. But wow. This is the first map I've seen on Left 4 Dead. To actually have a mystery box. That is pretty freaking awesome. Here we go. I guess this will be four minutes. Yep. Four minutes. I wonder if I could get the ray gun. That would just be epic. To have the ray gun on there for Dead 2. I watch this way. Y'all watch over there. Oh crap. Freaking charger. I'm running away from that. Crap, die. Please die. Please die. Please die. Please die. No. 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 Get away from me. Get away from me. Crap, I'm going back in here. Screw you guys. Oh, great. No. Oh, I'm down. Crap, man. I suck at this game. Oh, thank you, Bill. Come on, Bill. You got this? You got this? Yes. Crap. I need to heal. Oh crap, a freaking boomer. Okay. Bill killed the boomer. Awesome. Come on. I need a health packet or something. Or are you guys going to help me with that? Oh crap. This is game over. We are done for. Crap, I thought this would be pretty easy. And that charger's freaking still alive. Please tell me that charger died now. Oh crap. Next knockdown means death. Oh crap. Die. Please. Crap. No. No. Get away from me. I can't die. Oh, I already got some pills. Come on, take it. There we go. Okay. I got some drugs in me now. Drugs are bad, kids. Never take them. Come on, I'm about to beat my record. Come on. Come on. Oh, Molotov? Give me that then. Good thing it doesn't replace your weapon. There we go. Oh, crap. Please die. Everything dies. Yes, I beat my team record. Come on. Take that. Now come up here. Crap, go. Give me that stakeout. Or Spaz 12, whatever it is. 
Um, what's up here now? Oh, this is unlocked now. But do we really want to unlock that? Crap, I see a freaking charger coming. Oh, health pack. Give me that. Watch out, guys. I got a heal. Awesome. Oh, crap. Please die. Awesome. Okay. There we go. Oh, we can repair our ammo over here. I don't know if I really want to unlock that. I'm probably just going to keep that closed. Come on, we'll fix it against silver. Come on, die. Crap, where's my speed cola? Oh, what the heck is that? Come on, where's my speed cola when you need it? This kind of was. This is kind of making me want to play um, Nocturne and Totem What I Wore Days. Or What I Wore Style. For some reason. Okay, we gotta be 10 minutes now. Come on, we got this. Let's just hold off and heal. Do a final stand. Okay, there. That charger's dead. This shotgun is going to work, though. I wish I had some speed color on it though. This is actually pretty cool. I like this. I'm digging it. Oh crap. No. No. Die. Die. No. Did it die? I think it did. No it didn't. Crap I'm down. Crap, come on Zoe. Come on Zoe, you got this. Zoe, what are you doing? Okay, helping somebody other than me. Oh crap. Not good. Oh, thank you Zoe. Come on. Oh my gosh. Come on Francis. You got this. I'm protecting you. Yes. I am alive. Crap, this is a lot more hectic than Nocturne Totem is on what I wore. Jeez. A lot more hectic. Okay, come on. We got a minute 15 seconds to go. Hey, 115. That worked out perfectly. Die. Come on, we got this. Even though I have no health packs now. Wow, look at all those zombies. Oh yeah, M60. Oh yeah. Get smoked. Oh, really? Come on, come on. I want to smoke him. Come on. Oh, I got an achievement. Wow. No. Die. Okay, good. It's dead. Crap. I got two health left. I cannot afford to get hit again. Come on, we just got 20 seconds to go. Oh, crap. I got one health left. Come on. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Zoe. Come on. No! No! Nine minutes and fifty nine seconds and thirty milliseconds. So freaking close! So freaking close to the gold. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this little quick match or remake of Knocked on Totem. So, I hope you guys enjoy and stay tuned for more Left 4 Dead 2 and more zombie glory glory-ness. So, peace guys. Peace guys.